Hello everybody. On the bench today we have Toshiba T1000 SE computer. It's a uh, very old laptop. And uh, before I start putting any effort into it, I'd like to make sure it works. But I don't have a power adapter and I don't have a working battery. But uh, there's a way around that on some laptops. What we're going to do is uh, take the battery pack off. We'll take a look. This is a uh, DC 7.2 volt 1700 milliamp hour battery. Positive and negative terminals are marked. So what we can do is we can take our bench power supply and we've already got it set for the correct voltage. We'll just clip it onto the uh, leads here for positive and for negative. And we'll be able to open the laptop. We'll start our power supply. Okay, we're showing 7.2 volts. No current draw yet. We'll go ahead and press the power button. All right, we're pulling uh, 0.2 amps. System configuration error. A checksum error has occurred in the configuration RAM. Press any key for setup. Oh, our keyboard is not working very well here. Now let's see if we can find some adjustments on this screen. Well, I don't see any, but let's see if we can uh, see what we've got on the screen here. Ah, here we are. Ah, Toshiba Personal Computer MS-DOS version 3.30S. It is now Monday, January 1st, 1990, 12 o'clock. So, the system is up. And apparently we must be in ROM-DOS. I don't have a floppy in here. So, that's cool. Uh, looks like this is working. What we'll need to do from here is uh, see if we can find a correct power plug to fit in here and then I can feed it directly. Uh, probably need to restuff the battery. I can see here that the hinge is in, not in very good shape. Uh, the lower row on the keyboard, there's no spring in it. So, uh, actually, seems like it may be just the space bar that's having issues. So anyways, quick video there. Uh, that's a way to get around not having the correct power adapter if you have exposed battery terminals that you can get to. I'll go ahead and switch power supply off. And as you can see, the PC turned off. I've got another one of these in the garage that I can use for parts. So, uh, that'll be it for this short video. I'm going to do another couple of short videos and uh, then that way you guys will have something to watch. Guys and gals, I appreciate it. Uh, like, share, and subscribe and have a great night.